What's up guys, in this short tutorial, I will show you how to fix the issue when CSGO gets stuck during the map loading screen. This should be quite an easy tutorial, but if you still have any questions, then leave a comment and let me know. First, I suggest making sure that your GPU driver and operating system is up to date. In case you're using an NVIDIA graphics card, then use the GeForce Experience application. You can also use the AMD driver suit. In the Drivers tab, click on Download, and the application will automatically download and install the latest driver. Next, search for Update to open up your Check for Updates System Settings window. Here, select to download the latest OS update and restart your PC in order to install it. When this is done, open up your Steam library. Here, right-click CSGO and navigate to its properties. On this window, in the Local Files tab, select to verify the integrity of game files. This will take a minute to re-download and replace any missing or corrupted game files. When this is done, go back to the Local Files tab and select Browse Local Files. In your File Explorer, right-click the CSGO application and navigate to its properties. In the Compatibility tab, Make sure to run this program in Compatibility Mode 4, Windows 7, and disable full screen optimizations. Don't forget to apply your changes. Lastly, on this window, navigate to the General tab and then Set Launch Options. In this dialog box, make sure to copy these two commands from the description below. In case the problem persists, then your game files might be cluttered and are thus hindering the game from loading the map. In this case, you will have to uninstall and reinstall the game to your system. In your Steam library, right-click CSGO and under Manage, click on Uninstall. The last time I did this, about 90GB had been removed from my hard disk. And after reinstalling the game to my SSD, the load times had been reduced by over 50%. As a last resort, you should give the CSGO application an exception in your antivirus program, as it could be blocking parts of the software. I hope this helped you out, leave a comment if you have any questions and see you in the next one.